I'd like to tell you a little bit about our program here in Central Oregon. Uh, I'm Ken Hassagan, one of the two banders on the program. Uh, the program was started 22 years ago. Uh, we have fledged over 3,000 uh, young kestrels over the years. We have a total of 147 boxes this year, uh, about half of which will probably be active. We have approximately 12 to 15 monitors who monitor these boxes every year. Uh, one monitor has 27 boxes, another has 24 boxes, some have only two or three or five. It's a great program, it gets us outside, beautiful weather, beautiful country. Uh, we have a waiting list, but no one wants to quit. Hi there, my name is Jen Sinisak, and I am here at our American Kestrel Partnership Nest Box Monitoring Site, conveniently located in my own backyard in Arahan, Panama. As you can see, we are in a residential subdivision, but the area has uh, plenty of open space, ideal for American kestrel habitat. When we moved here in 2017, American kestrel was literally one of the first birds we saw. We put up the nest box in January of 2018. The pair came to inspect in February, and eggs were laid in March. Since then, we have had three successful nesting seasons, each fledging three young. As far as we know, this is the only successful nest box being monitored uh, here in Panama on the project. We hope that the data that we provide from our nest monitoring site and others in Panama contribute to the greater understanding of resident populations of American kestrels here in Panama and Central America and to American kestrel research as a whole. Hey, I'm Joe Tom Show with the North Carolina Wildlife Resources Commission. And I'm Mark Opie with Southern Appalachian Raptor Research. Together, we've been monitoring about 40 nest boxes across Sandy Mush game lands here and other places in Western North Carolina. Well, we've also banded up close to 400, over 400 nestlings over the last, since 2013. And we're fixing a color band about three nestlings in this box pretty soon. Thanks and have a great day. Thanks for your work. Hello, my name is Julia. My husband Peter and I live in Northwest Boise and we have one kestrel nest box approximately 30 feet behind our house, which means that we can watch the activity from the kitchen and dining room windows. We put the box up about seven years ago, and we have had kestrels occupy the box every year and nestlings who have fledged. This year we had three nestlings in the box, and we expect them to fledge in the next three or four days. Hello, my name is Gene Grishan, and I work for the Calvert County Natural Resources Division in Southern Maryland. I monitor 15 kestrel boxes during the summer, and in 2019, I started a successful winter raptor trapping project that focuses mainly on American kestrels. In the future, we would like to be able to use color field readable bands and modus transmitters to better our understanding of kestrels on their wintering ground. I'm very excited to be working with the American Kestrel Partnership to better promote conservation of this species.